The holiday weekend has brought in visitors from all over the southeastern United States, creating a much different scene on the beaches this weekend than this time a month ago. As News 13's Erica Orsad tells us, the pandemic doesn't seem to have had an effect on the weekend's tourism. It's a polar opposite view than the empty beaches of five weeks ago. Uh, they are super crowded. Umbrellas and tents are set up for miles as people flock back to the beach for Memorial Day weekend. According to some of those visitors, the virus seems to have taken a back seat in the minds of many. It's a good time down here. Yeah, people don't seem to be worried about it as much. For others, it's still a minor concern, but they say people are respecting personal space, even in groups larger than 10. Everyone's coming in and having fun and just let them have fun, but like people are panicky about it, so they stay their own little ways. While some residents feel that it's all happening too soon, others disagree. I'm glad to see everybody enjoying themselves the way it should be down here in Panama City Beach. For restaurants like Patches near St. Andrews State Park, the foot traffic has gone up considerably. I didn't think we would be this busy this quick. We went from zero to a thousand miles an hour overnight. Owner Vince Greiner says he's happy to see people back, but wishes that other businesses could say the same. There's some businesses that aren't open that, that everybody should be experiencing. There's no word yet on when closed establishments like bars will be able to reopen. In Bay County, Erica Orstad, News 13, Panhandle Strong.